Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Jamie Plays with me, Jamie. So, we are in that situation again where the base game Stellaris from Paradox Interactive has updated, but unfortunately for whatever reason the Star Trek New Horizons mod has not yet been updated. And you're wondering, well until the update comes out, how am I going to be able to play this amazing mod from this amazing team of devs? There's actually a very simple answer, and it's to do with the Stellaris version itself. So, let's say it's just updated to the version 3.2, and unfortunately the Star Trek New Horizons mod is still on version 3.1.2. So what you can do in Steam, simply right-click on your game, and then go to uh, Properties. Here it will open up a window that looks like this. And what we need to do is we need to go to betas. So if you currently aren't on a beta version, all you would you would see something here like that says none, and all you would need to do is select the version you want to be. So the oldest versions are here at the top, and the newest versions are here at the bottom. So all we'd simply do, for example, is let's go back to 3.1.2. You would click it and say, okay, perfect. And then as you noticed, when I clicked the other version, it started to download that version of the game. So what will happen, for example, is Stellaris will download that version. So let's say I go back into properties, I choose um, 2.1.3, which right now is a very, very old version. And you will see here that it says update queued um, and that it will start to download depending on what settings you have. As you see here, 1.3 megabytes per second. It will download, it will install, and everything will be fine. Um, so I'm going to go back to 3.1.2, like that. Something else you will notice is that next to the name, it will also say the version that you are currently at. So I am currently on 3.1.2. I'm not on the newest 3.2 update that came out with the Aquatic Species Pack, for example. So that's all you have to do. Once you click play here, it will then go ahead and open the launcher and give it a second. It will open the launcher and you notice that you will be able to play the game. So all you would have to do is hit the play button and assuming that your Star Trek New Horizons version is now the same version as your Stellaris version, everything will work as it did before the update. Well guys, thanks for joining us. If you haven't already, make sure you give the video a big thumbs up and subscribe to both of our channels. If you find you're struggling at all with Star Trek New Horizons, then please do check out our tips, tricks and tutorials playlist linked in the description below and at the end of this video. We also have a Discord server we call The Collective. We discuss everything from these videos to Star Trek in general to what we're having for Sunday lunch. We also make our announcements there as well and organize multiplayer games that you can play with us. You can join our collective using the link in the description below. The collective must grow. All right, that's it from us for now. See you next time. Make it so.